Cannabis, IQ, and aging. Does cannabis protect against cognitive decline? Does using cannabis accelerate cognitive decline as we age? A new study takes a closer look at this controversial question, tracking over 5,000 men across a 44-year period to uncover surprising results. Contrary to common assumptions, the study found that cannabis users experienced slightly less cognitive decline from early adulthood to late midlife compared to non-users. Researchers measured cognitive changes using military intelligence tests taken at an average age of 20 and then again at 64. The difference in cognitive decline between users and non-users was modest, about 1.3 IQ points, but significant when accounting for lifestyle, education, and health factors. Interestingly, neither the age at which cannabis use began, nor the frequency of use, had a measurable impact on long-term cognitive changes. These findings challenge the perception that cannabis inherently accelerates cognitive aging and align with some prior research, suggesting that cognitive effects may be temporary or reversible with prolonged abstinence. But before we draw broad conclusions, the study had limitations. It focused solely on men and relied on self-reported cannabis use, which can introduce bias. Moreover, most cannabis users in the study had abstained for years by the time of follow-up, potentially allowing any adverse effects to subside. This study underscores the complexity of how cannabis interacts with the brain across a lifetime. While it offers reassurance that moderate past use may not lead to significant cognitive harm, more research is needed, especially with diverse populations and ongoing cannabis trends. For now, the findings remind us that the effects of cannabis, like the brain itself, are not always straightforward. This video is based on the research paper Cannabis Use and Age-Related Changes in Cognitive Function from Early Adulthood to Late Midlife in 5,162 Danish Men by Christine Marup Hug et al. in Brain and Behavior. What do you think about this study? Drop us a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.